Hey guys, and welcome back to Taylor Tech. Today, we are going to be talking about a piece of software that I've been using called Voice Meter, which is extremely handy. Essentially, what it is is a software mixer that can be used to mix audio signals within a PC um, and give you a lot more flexibility than uh, just the basic Windows options do when it comes to routing sound. Use case for this piece of software is if you have a really basic routing problem when it comes to sound inside your PC. Uh, for an example, you have two USB headsets and you want to mix the mics of those two headsets together. Windows does not give you any native options to do this and a lot of applications will only let you select one audio input. What Voice Meter will do will, is allow you to mix those two sounds, those two mics together and then have a single output that it can be used as the microphone then in that application. So let's do a tour of the software. So this is the voice meter interface. Uh, as you can see, it is optimized for touch. Um, it would work really well with the touch screen. All the controls are nice and big. And so what you end up having is you have two hardware inputs. You've got one virtual input and then two, uh, a hardware output and a virtual output. That's your A and your B. You also have selectable routing. Any of the two hardware, one virtual input can be sent to either or A and B. So one or both. You have, a, you have the option to force a channel to mono. You also have uh, a solo and mute functionality for each channel, as well as for the main channels. The virtual input can accept up to four applications at a time, uh, sending sound to it. Same thing for the virtual output. It can be used by up to four applications at a time. The hardware output can have two separate physical hardware outputs that it's sending sound to with up to eight channels on each output. So in terms of limitations, uh, you know, there's not a lot of limitations with this software other than the fact that you are limited to what you see on the screen. You only have two hardware inputs. You are limited to a single virtual input that four applications can go to, but that you cannot mix those four applications independently. You have to adjust all of their levels at the same in, with one fader, meaning you have to mix those applications before you send them to the virtual input. So you still could be frustrated by doing a lot of tabbing if you're trying to mix several software applications together. One thing that this piece of software really has going for it, though, is the price, which is technically zero. Um, it is donationware, meaning that there is no fixed price that you must pay for the software. You can pay what you feel is right. While it is not perfect by any means, being limited as it is, it is worth something and you know for my sake it's worth about five bucks which is what i've donated to uh, vb audio the creators of this software so i mean in terms of quality the audio quality that it puts out is fine for most applications um you know i've i've not used it as the primary audio recording or transmission software you do see my voice in there right now but that's the voice level that would be going to TeamSpeak. so a quick example of how you would use this software um you know i've got this output from my mixer that is mono um, and it's coming into the PC which is expecting stereo. So what I did is I fed it in as a hardware input, forced it to mono so that I get both channels being evenly fed and people don't only hear me in one ear. And then I have it going to B which is my virtual output. Um, in TeamSpeak, I then on my capture device selected voice meter output um, which if you look in recording devices, that's actually listed as a microphone there, voice meter output. If you look in, input, in playback devices, you also have voice meter input, which is where you can tell applications to send sound to um, so that you can mix multiple applications together. So overall, this is a handy piece of software. It's great when you're in a pinch and you need a simple routing solution in your PC and you don't want to go spending a bunch of money on hardware. I personally use it currently while I'm waiting for some stuff to arrive from Amazon. And I've, I've found it useful. I'll probably keep it installed it and use it in the future. All right, guys, I hope this overview of Voice Meter was helpful for you. It's a nice, handy little piece of software when you're in a pinch with routing on a PC. If you like this video, then throw a like on it. Also, any, leave any comments for me below. I love interacting with you. If you found this video helpful, uh, please share it out to your friends. That really helps me. Uh, and if you're not currently subscribed to the channel, go ahead and subscribe so that you can see more content like this in the future. There's a links in the description section to places you can find me on the internet like Reddit and Twitter. And yeah, thanks for watching guys. Have a great one.